Shalom and welcome to two minutes of Torah. This year is entitled the halacha of Rabbim of ten people that one dies al kiddush Hashem ten, in front of ten people is ten people seeing the act or knowing about the act. So we've been having a few uh, shurim in our mini series on kiddush Hashem dying al kiddush Hashem. Certain times it doesn't make a difference who sees. For the big three, one must give up one's life, and if uh, it is uh, they rob him in public and it's not one of the big three he trafe and it's done public in order to humiliate Judaism to insult Judaism then one must give up his life and if it's during the time of decrees as well so when we say that if it's in public one must give up his life it's that if the goal is to insult Judaism what does it mean they rob him 10 people does it mean that 10 people actually see what's going on, which would be the natural assumption? The Shah has a fascinating point. In Yeradeya Kufnun Zayin, he writes that doesn't mean that 10 people, the 10 Jews, see the event, but rather they know about the event. So it's a big Kiddush to say such a thing. He says, why would that be? Because we see from Esther, the Gemara says, Baha Esther Befar Hesia. Wait a second. Maybe Esther should have given up her life and not remained with Achashverosh because that was public. Then the question, of course, is how is that public? She was, wasn't with Achashverosh publicly in an intimate way. It was privately behind closed doors. So the Shach says everyone knew about it because everyone knew about it. Therefore, it was considered public. It was considered Rabim. So the Shach says so too. If a Jew is going to be faced with the decision to trafe but it's known what's going on, even if it's not seen, he says that would be considered Robin. Shalom.